Okay, uh, your cue card is describe a water sport you would like to try in the future. So it means it's in future. Or describe a sport you would like to try for the first time. What is it present? Where you will do it? Future. Whether it is easy or difficult? Again, present. And why would you like to try it? That is future. Right? Okay. So please, you got to speak on this topic for one to two minutes. Your time starts now. All the beaches along Pakistan's coast uh, have huge prospect uh, of development and conduct of uh, a wide variety of uh, water sports activity. And, uh, but there are many available like parasailing and scuba diving and so on. I would like to try uh, scuba diving because uh, it's a unique sport and uh, it's my first prior priority to do in the future. And uh, scuba diving is a unique activity. Uh, it's not that easy to uh, do it by yourself. You need a you need a special skill and trainer for this sport. And uh, uh, so I I'll be planning to visit uh, Karachi, Clifton, Karachi, with my friends and cousins. So. Uh, when I search about this place, uh, I feel so surprised to know that uh, Karachi is a conduct, uh, Karachi Coast conduct uh, this kind of sports. So they also conduct uh, uh, undersea, undersea diving and uh, I will go there and try because I want to uh, come over uh, the fear of uh, undersea swimming. Okay. All right, that's good overall. You spoke for one minute and 28 seconds. Uh, the thing is, there were some pauses and at one point you stopped. So this should not happen because uh, you need to go on in part uh, two. You have to express your fluency. So this is how you can just show your fluency that you talk without any pauses. Uh, I mean, you produced very good sentences also. But another thing is you're lacking energy that energy and excitement. So you need to add that energy and excitement. But still, your English is good enough to give you six band easily. But if you're looking for higher band, then you need to overcome your pauses, means fluency should be there. And there is one thing we call it intonation. There should be proper intonation. Intonation means expression through your voice. Like if you are happy, you say, today I'm very happy. If you're sad, you say, today I'm very sad. This is what we call intonation. Okay. So this should be intonation, right? Thank you. All the best.